Hey everybody, Kelly Ritchie here. Welcome to The Cutting Edge. It is September, it's hard to believe. I hope everyone is staying safe and getting some good time into practice. So let's dive in and see what we're going to focus on this month. This month, I would like to place our focus on three areas. One, I'd like to wrap up blues rock songs in the key of E so next month we can move into the key of A. Number two, we're going to look at songwriting. And number three, we're going to go a little bit deeper into guitar techniques, those tips and tricks. Number one, we're wrapping up blues rock songs in the key of E with Something's Going On. Now this is a song that I wrote, uh, maybe Stevie Ray influenced with a harder edge, very riff driven, E minor pentatonic, here in your root five position, but also a lot going on in the open position. So if you're a beginner student, this would be good to watch, but know that it's there's this is a challenge. So you'll be able to pick up some nuggets. If you're an intermediate student, this is a great song to really chunk down every inch of it and extract from it what you can. And if you're an advanced student, I think you're really gonna get a lot from this. It's a really good challenge, a really good workout. It's a lot of fun. Number two, songwriting. I had a student ask that I add some songs from my Sweet Spirit record. And when I looked, I realized there are a number of songs from that record, but there's several that I hadn't taught. So I thought, you know, this would be a really good opportunity to teach a song from Sweet Spirit and to do so through the lens of songwriting. So I tell the whole story of where the song came from. I wrote it originally on the acoustic guitar, and I'm gonna teach you how to play the song, stripped down version from the acoustic. And I talk about where the song came from, the archives that I had, how to mine material from your archives, and the importance of capturing all of your ideas. Then, how to take a song idea, develop it, do a demo, and take it into the studio. Now I've done 16 CDs, so it was really important for me to not just bring new material, but to also keep developing as a guitarist. So with this song, I actually had some video footage from the studio where I was playing this crazy guitar solo that in the studio we were able to flip around backwards and do this big psychedelic thing with. Now how do I take that on stage? So I talk about the entire evolution. In the coming weeks and months, I'm going to be adding to the song pack. I'm gonna grab an electric guitar and show you how I use a beer bottle to play slide, the different delays that I use, and uh, we'll do a deeper dive. And number three, blues soloing techniques. Continuing that conversation. I'm gonna put a link to where that folder is, everything from hammer-ons, pull-offs, pinch harmonics, slides, bends, flat tire. You know, if you're new to playing guitar solos, you're going to be learning how to do these things maybe for the first time. If you're an intermediate player, it may be easy to think, you know, I know how to do hammer-ons and pull-offs. I would encourage you to really spend some time in this folder and really take advantage of each of the tips and tricks because there's a lot to learn. Now, if you've been playing for a while and you're really wanting to build your vocabulary and to develop your own style, these techniques are critical. This is how we animate each and every note that we play. So take the time to watch these and, and take everything that you can from my style and make it your own. So that's where we're placing our focus this month. If anybody has any questions, please be sure to post them in the forum. I'll do my best to answer them. If there's material you'd like for me to cover in the coming months, let me know. I will do my best. If there's an area that you're working on or struggling with, you can always pick up a private lesson. I'm here for video exchange or I teach throughout the week via Skype and Zoom. Practice hard and have fun. Okay, take care.